Hi, I'm Xenowave, and today I'm going to show you how I made this sound. Here it is in context. Okay, so the main concept behind the sound is just tremolo on an FM sig signal being sent into distortion and delay. So operator one is just a saw wave. I have a volume, I have the volume routed to mod X. And operator two is just a sine wave. And I'm just modulating with um, negative phase and I have the ratio set to four. Operator six is just a direct or direct sub out. I have a little bit of tension on here, uh, just for more harmonics. And I have the volume set to mod X as well for movement. So it sounds like this. And so just a flat, flat sub. I feel like that really, it's a small detail, but I feel like it really makes a difference. And filter one, there is no filtering going on. This is off. I just have the wave shaper on, and this is my shape for it. Uh, feel free to play with that as needed. And I have um, just the delay, delay three on. Just one delay. No chorus, no reverb. Um, and I have the feedback level at, at default i have the delay time set to 14 milliseconds uh no stereo offset and i have 100 percent volume and ping pong is on that's that's the sound really um with just this configuration though for the uh, fm matrix you can get a lot of timbres out of it so for example let's just i'm just gonna mess around this knob and see what we get this back So yeah, that's pretty fun. And on top of that, you can mess with um, the ratio. They didn't have before. And you mess with the also tab, of course. The list goes on and on. I actually do, do suggest you automate this um, volume knob. I already did that in a previous take of this. Funny enough, I um, was recording the window instead of the actual display, and I have I usually have my citrus detached. So the citrus just wasn't in that take of the video. It's pretty funny. But yeah, um, take note that 50% is um, actually, 0% over here. 100% is positive 100%. And 0% in the automation clip is negative 100%. So take note of that. But if you automate this, you'll get, you can have a lot of fun with it. So here's what it sounds like um, at 0%. And then negative 100%. Positive 100. And then you start playing around with it. And then with drums. And you can just keep on just going crazy with it. this 
over. The tiniest differences will really shape the song. You get the idea. That would be fun to play with. But yeah, that's the sound. Um, if you have any questions, let me know and have an awesome day.